In this video, I'm going to show you how you can install Chromium OS onto a laptop or computer and essentially turn it into a Chromebook. And for this, you'll need a 4GB or larger USB stick. So you'll need to download the Cloud Ready zip file and you'll also need to have the Chromebook Recovery Utility. And links for these will be in the description below. But here you can see the tabs just open here. And now I'm just going to open the Recovery Utility and we're going to want to go up to the little settings icon in the top right and click Use Local Image. Then navigate to your cloud ready image zip and then you'll want to pick the usb stick that you're going to use i'm going to select this one i'm just going to click continue and this image writing process will take around 15 minutes but i've sped this up quite a lot and essentially we're just writing the image to the usb stick so we can boot it up from the computer so now we can see that this is finished so i'm going to click done and then we're going to take out the USB stick and put it into the computer. So this is the computer that I'm going to use. It's a HP Mini. It's fairly old. It's got one gig of RAM and it's got an Intel Atom processor. So it's very low end. And we're just going to see how Chromium OS can perform on this computer. So I'm just doing this so you can see if you have an old computer lying around, you can install an operating system and hopefully bring it back to life. So this is the USB stick that I'm using. And I'm showing you this because this one did not work for some reason and I have no idea why. So I'm going to plug in the USB stick and I'm just going to turn on the computer and I'm going to want to go to the startup options screen and then I'm going to pick the boot device as the USB stick. And now you should see on the screen the cloud ready logo appear on the screen and it will boot up. It takes around a few minutes and then we are on the welcome screen. So if you just want to install this straight off, you can go to the menu in the bottom right and click install cloud ready. But I'm going to run it off the USB stick as you can essentially use it as a live CD. So I've selected the language settings and I've connected to the Wi-Fi. And the setup process is very simple. You connect to the Wi-Fi, log into your Google account, and that's pretty much it. So I'm just going through the setup process here. And just moving on, going to log into my Google account. And now, as you can see, this is the desktop and all of the function buttons work on the keyboard, which I was surprised by. That's really good. As you can see, I'm adjusting the brightness and volume. So let's just see how this actually performs. So I'm going to open up the browser and I'm going to go to the Rich Tech website just to see how it loads. And it took a while to load, but it eventually loaded and it's performing all right. So here you can see it's loaded most of the sites, just getting a few of the social icons in the top right loading. But here you can see it is working out of the box and I'm pretty impressed by that as I've used this on a few other computers and it's just worked flawlessly so far in my testing. And here you can see it's playing a YouTube video completely fine and we're just gonna put this into full screen just to see how that works. You see, it takes a bit, but there we go. Watching the video in full screen, it's not stuttering or anything. Pretty impressive. But that's been it for this video. Thanks for watching, and I'll see you in the next one.